I can't code, so I can't build my online learning app. Well, that's not true anymore. You can build your own learning app on desktop and mobile today. So follow the steps in this video to create your learning app database with me. The fastest way to build your learning app is to use the free template we prepared for you. You can find it in the description below, so you can jump right onto it now. Also, you can find it in the template gallery. So dashboard, go into templates, app templates, education category. As you see in the app, you can create multiple menus and sub-menus to organize your lessons. And you can add as many pages inside them. Each page can include lessons in them, and you can go through each lesson quickly. Okay, now let me show you how you can create these lessons. You will have a folder in your dashboard when you edit your template. And in that folder, all your lesson formulas exist. Edit one. And there you can edit the content of the lessons by clicking on each section field. You can add photos in your section field, and you can change the width and height of your image to adjust it with your content. You can also use the video field type to embed your Vimeo and YouTube videos. Click the video field type or drag and drop it to the page and add your video's URL in its properties. To embed a web page also, you can use the embed field type. Add to it your page and enter the web page URL in its properties. Also in settings, you can add height so you can see. So let me know in the comments, what multimedia do you use in your lessons? Do you prefer video, text, images, or GIFs? Leave your top favorite learning multimedia in the comments now. Okay, moving on with our learning app. You can also add short quizzes in between your lessons to make them more engaging. And also your audience can test their knowledge in between your lessons. You can use different fields to ask questions. For example, use the CSAT field to ask how your audience is feeling so far. You can also ask your audience to explain something in a long text format. Upload files and select a choice in a multiple choice question. In the end, you can add a survey section in your app to receive overall feedback from your audience. You can choose the student feedback survey template that we've prepared for you. And we'll also include a link to it in the description area, so make sure to check it out. Edit the template to make a copy of it in your dashboard. You can then move it to the custom learning app folder to keep things organized. To add the survey into your app, edit the app, click on add page button in your menu. Add a block and choose the student feedback database to be shown as a form view. And here you have your survey inside of your learning app. To publish to your app with your audience, find the app settings in your apps menu and enable the public view, save and now the public link to your app is enabled and ready to share. You can also create a mobile version for your learning app. The mobile app will be connected to the same database as you see in the web version and you can publish it in Google Play too. To learn more about mobile apps, check out our GitHub page. You can find its link in the description area. Also, we can build your mobile app for you and connect it to your learning database inside Formulu. So contact us on the website chat. Building a learning app can be an impactful way to engage and educate your audience. So if you want to create one, start with the ready to customize template we've prepared for you. You can grab it at the link below this video, and I know it's gonna help you so much as it has helped hundreds of Formulures so far. Did this video help you? How are you going to use this learning app and for what goals? Let me know in the comments below. I can't wait to chat with you there after the video and I'll see you in the next one. If you like this video, hit the like button below and share with your friends and be sure to subscribe. Happy formulaing! Bye!